I know you have seen so many things in this life, but have you seen where they farm mosquito? As a person, they train mosquito. I know you have not seen it. Watch this video. People, they're busy, they farm cassava garriewa. This man is busy farming mosquito. But his reason for doing that will surely shock you. Watch the video and share it to your friends. It's very interesting, I swear. Credit to Lucky Udu. One love. How many of you have seen a mosquito farm before? This man has a mosquito farm in Nigeria and he believes that the enzymes from mosquito may have something to do with the cure for HIV AIDS. Hi, my name is Dr. Manying. I have a mosquito farm in Nigeria and I believe that the enzymes in the mosquitoes will have something in the cure of HIV AIDS. Everybody is trying to get rid of mosquitoes. Why are you saving them? Yes, we are raiding these mosquitoes for different purposes. Uh, one major one is that we all know that mosquitoes are known to transmit so many diseases. So many diseases, a vector of so many diseases, including malaria. But it does not transmit HIV virus. Now, this lab is interested in finding out that which makes the mosquito not viable tools for HIV transmission, even though they are known to uh, soak blood and then mix up the biting even in the same room when you have one or two persons there but it does not transmit the hiv virus now we want to know the enzymes in the mosquito or the saliva or the digestion process from the stomach wall through the thorax to the salivary gland before it bites what happens during this journey that makes the virus to die so that it cannot be transmitted to the next person so you believe that an experiment like this might lead to finding out the cure for hiv aids yes that is the potential uh aim of this we have started at the preliminary level we are gradually moving on to see to extract the enzymes from the mosquitoes undergo certain tests on it to see so that at the end of the day if it is found out that there's anything in the mosquitoes that is responsible for killing the virus we may explore that avenue to produce a vaccine from there so that it can be used for the cure of HIV. All right, that's very brilliant. I must commend you. What other experiment is going on here? Yes, another experiment we're doing here is we're trying to see that, uh, you know, mosquitoes have become resistant to different insecticides that have been in use. So now we are trying to test, doing an experiment to see which chemicals that may have more killing effect that they are more potent in killing the mosquito as compared to others. So that at the end of the day, we can recommend for mosquito net uh, manufacturing. We call it resistant testing. And another thing is that we use these mosquitoes for lectures and practicals. We do dissection of the mosquito to see whether do those mosquitoes have undergone mating with the females. Are they carrying spermatozoa? Have they beaten somebody before? Have they laid eggs before? And if they have laid eggs before, how many batches of eggs? So that all these things will help us in knowing the uh, the lifespan of the mosquito and how dangerous it is in disease transmission. All right, it's very impressive. Um, what stage is this right now? How far have you gone with this experiment? Yes, uh, so far we have been able to uh, rear the mosquitoes to adult stages at several instances and we're in the process of extracting the enzymes enzyme extraction so that from there we will to go deeper and find out that which is making the virus not to survive even though on the what is making the hiv virus not to survive in yes uh, what is making the hiv virus not to survive in the mosquitoes even though it buys a hiv patient with the virus but then along the way it dies off primarily we know in primary science that the uh, the mosquito don't have the receptor site which are the T cells that human beings have where the virus is, is expected to bind and then continue its own uh, life cycle. Mosquitoes don't have that. But at least other enzymatic activities take place in order to quicken this process of killing the virus. We're interested in trying to get to the root of this.